All right, hello and welcome back to some more Ashes of Ariandel. The last time on, <laughs> I really don't even know what to say. We came through a snowy desert and arrived at this castle across a bridge, and we talked to Sister Frida. Frida, return from whence thou camest. Whose name I recognize, and I'm sure that we'll be back here for her later. And we found a ladder, so we're gonna go check what's up here. <clears throat> This is nice. This is a nice area here. Nice room. It's got some painting tools. That's really, really pretty there. It's just some white streaks. I love that. I love that for for this. Yep. Okay. All right. This is definitely going to be relevant later. All right. <clears throat> but there's nothing there now. So I'm pretty sure that the cost of a level is something like 100 grand. So 36k is not enough to go back and do anything with right now. So. All right, so now we've talked to Fried. Do you have anything different to say? Frieda has spoken, is she not? Then tarry no longer. There is one inside the cold paint stray from the withering flame. And the snow will swallow you whole. <laughs> there is one thing in... Oh, he's coming back to kill us. <laughs> if ever. If ever an NPC was going to be an invader later. Are you guys hostile towards me? I did murder you. Um, ruthlessly last time, so I, I hope that, I hope that you're okay. Should I check to see if this is um? Oh wait, that does look like maybe this side of the ladder would go down. Well, shoot, I don't know which way to go first. I gotta try bridge, right? Let's do bridge. Do I just have to hit it once? I probably just have to hit it once. And then slowly, yep. Very slow process. <clears throat> You gotta be a ladder. You gotta be. Yes, sir. Okay, so not on the other side, but on this side, we have a ladder. I don't know. My gut says to do this way first, so we're gonna try this first, and then we'll go over. Well, actually, where is that? That looks like it wraps back around. I don't. I have no idea. I have no idea if I'm doing things in even the remotely right order. That's kind of a cool drop spot. He's like in. That little crevice. Uh, more frost help, which means more frost enemies. Okay, well, this is suspicious, and that's all I have to say about that, right? Like, right? Like, look at these branches. They definitely all lead somewhere. The question is, do we go straight onto that branch, or do we make our way around? Oh, I miss you. <laughs> So I'm actually not doing as much damage to them with my Great Machete. Is it? I don't know. It's not as big. It's not like as heavy as a weapon as, as the Fort's Great Hammer is, though. I kind of want to keep using it. Let me look at my damage output just curiously. 308 plus 233, so like almost 600. What's that? Like 580. 595. 595 about. Um... Vort's Great Hammer is doing 320 plus 235. That's actually less. That's like 5... Well, it's about the same, actually. 585 or something like that. 30, 40, 50. No. 550 something. Okay, so it is doing less. Great Sword is doing 294 plus 329. That's a big plus. Holy cow. Because it's got A-grade strength scaling compared to what? A-grade strength scaling? <laughs> 294 plus 329. It's like six that's over 600 Ooh, but it's a lot slower well let's try it just on the off chance we might be able to like one hit some dudes fairly effectively okay <gasps> yes sir okay so this was that one that we were looking at right there's nothing else up here doesn't look like it. Oh, there's a crystal lizard. This is definitely a bad idea. Something bad is going to happen to us. You know what? I'm just prepared to die here. You know? We just have to be... You just have to be prepared to die. Yep. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Huh. We one hit the crystal lizard, which is better than Grey Machete, right? Okay, so wait, where? There's arrows coming from, like, over there. Right? Or somewhere? 
Oh golly. Oh golly. I don't like this. There's gonna be bad men around here. I can just feel it in my bones. Alright, come here, come here, come here, come here. Oh, your shield really blocked that for you, my friend? I don't think so. We have we're gonna how are we alive? How are we alive? How are we alive? I was like, well, we're dead, but we're not. Okay, stop. Oh, this is scary. Is that was that a bonfire down there? Or was it just like a straight fire? I don't know what I'm doing. We're going this way. I see an item. Oh my gosh. You're still not one hit. You're still not one hit, even with this thing two-handed. I'm switching back to Greg Machete for the speed, at least right now, because it, it's just really helping me. This for right now. I'm actually liking how it feels towards these enemies, so. Like, you can range them pretty good and do pretty significant damage, so that's really beneficial. I don't know the best way to do it with these freaking arrows. They're so loud, though. This just, that sound is, like, really loud in my freaking earbuds. I don't know where I'm going. Please don't shoot me off the logs. Okay, so there was a guy, there was a guy up there, but it doesn't look like he has anything. Oh, he fell off, yay, okay. Holy mackerel, we're going off the side. Oh, and we died. Really, that didn't seem like that fall far to me, but you know what, it probably was like This is a bit rough. We definitely just have to keep moving. I don't know if we should just like go for the bottom. I, I have no idea. It doesn't seem like there's any good way to like clear out the archers though. That's my only thing. Let's go this way this time. Wait, actually does this even... Can I like roll off of it towards here? Yeah, I can. Okay. That was what I was thinking in my head. Oh! Oh, this is... Is this different? No, is it? Maybe it is. Maybe we went in lower last time. Okay, let me just try to not avoid you. I don't know. Where's the archer? Is he below? Let me try to run up here quick. See what the situation is. I don't know where this is. Oh, we're above where we came down on the bridge now. That's very interesting. And it's literally purposeless? <laughs> There's no reason to be above where the bridge came down. Unless, was there something that I missed, like, dropping off? It doesn't look like it. But we're here now. I'm gonna cry to just keep moving. Um, oh wait, you're one of the archers. Oh! Oh, ooh, I got you. So maybe this will help me a little bit. If we put a stop to you, sir. Titanite from him? Are we still being shot at? Yeah, you would think things would be a little bit smoother now because um, we're dealing with slightly less, but there's at least one more archer, if not two more. I, I can't really tell. But... No! No, 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 quit! Oh, I almost had that quit out! <laughs> Gosh darn it. Only 30,000 souls, right? I'm going to... Okay. We're going to really quickly run back to Firelink Shrine because I'd like to know how many... I should have put on a ring of sacrifice there. I didn't think of it. But I guess 30,000 is not that many. Let me just make sure. I feel like in my head I'm thinking that we're at like 100,000 for an upgrade. But the fact that we only have 30,000 and we've already gone through what feels like an entire area of the DLC. 
Tells me that I could be wrong, so. Oh, 60,000. Okay, so we were about halfway to a level that we just lost, but whatever. Whatever. Uh, I'll be okay. I'll, I'll manage. It is what it is. I'm not going to get too upset about it here. This freaking area. Holy cow. Not one of the Souls game's strengths is their parkour levels. <laughs> Although, it's, and it's sort of like a special thing. The fact that you die by falling off a beam because the ability to walk in straight lines and land on beams is incredibly difficult in this game. <laughs> Even when they're big, wide trees like this, it's ridiculously difficult. Because Dark Souls is not a platformer. <laughs> eh. Maybe I shouldn't have done this first. Maybe I should have... Well, I just keep thinking that that looks... See, look, it goes the whole way, see? Right? Like, it goes the whole way down. Let's see if we can get a view when we go down the ladder of what's down there. Yeah, yeah, there's definitely stuff down there. Like, that's definitely a new area. And I feel like this might be more of a side area. Yeah, see, that's like a whole thing down there. I definitely think this is what we should do first. Oh, boy. I guess we'll do the arrow guy again. I don't know. I'm gonna try it this way. Yes. Oh, I didn't take out a fall damage from that. Now he's still gonna be shooting us. Which is not a good thing. Alright. Whoa, is it? Alright, this is ridiculous. I tell you what. This is awful. I don't like it, not one bit. Excuse me, sir. Wait, there's a bonfire down there. Okay, so we definitely have to get down here. What's down here? Another archer? Okay. <laughs> well, at least you're shooting me backwards this time instead of forward. I'm just gonna roll. Oh, okay. Alright, well, let's please not be one of the places where the ice just, like, caves in under my feet. I, I don't want that for us today. I'm just going for this fire. Okay, alright. Okay, alright. Back at old 3,000 souls, but I'm sure that there will be a way to come about more. Hmm. Crabs. My favorite. They're my favorite enemy. Crabs are. I don't know where to go. Let's go away from the crab first. That's what my gut says to do. See what the situation is over here. Alright. Okay, so that's that village up. Oh boy. Oh boy, that's a boss fight. Okay. Um, well. Maybe we will do the crabs first. Okay. Let's run over here. Hopefully these archers won't shoot at me the whole time. I don't know how visible I am to them. Okay, so some of them are invisible too, for sure. There's not even items or anything over here. It's pointless. Completely pointless. Please stop shooting at me. Are they gonna shoot at me when I fight the crabs now that they've spotted me? It seems like they can't because I'm not really under them, but. Crabs are really not enjoyable enemies. Crossbite crabs. That's fun for you. We're gonna get wrecked, we're gonna get wrecked, we're gonna get wrecked. Can I, I would really love to deal with just like one of you at a time. If we die, we're just going to be running past them. I'm not entirely sure why I'm fighting them. I'm really hoping that, like, maybe there's some kind of good loot here in disguise somewhere. Okay. Two of you at once is just... I mean, one of you is already just a call to fight, and two of you is just a joke. Please, I can't even... You're moving, like, through each other. That's not fair at all. Back up, back up! <laughs> Just stop, just stop. Hold on. Okay, hold on. We don't have near enough endurance on this character. Holy cow, but... Yeah. 
Okay, frostbit. Even with my frostbite resistant ring, which tells you that there'd be some frostbite going on here. Okay, this is horrible. This is horrible, yeah. <laughs> Why did I decide to fight the crabs instead of just run past them? I'm pretty sure I run past them in every part of the game. I've never fight, never stopped to fight the crabs. They're just not fun to fight. Especially two at the same time. And it's almost always two at the same time. <clears throat> well, at least we spawned down here. Okay, so now we're gonna go see what's past the crabs, because there'd definitely be some space back there. Not honestly, not that it's any easier to run past crabs than it is to fight them. Oh, okay, so the other one wasn't there originally, and then he just popped out the ice to say hello. Okay, alright, okay, alright, alright, okay, alright, okay, alright, okay, alright. This is a living tree here. Yes, yes sir. Oh, you didn't die? You just made a big noise? Okay. supposed to do two R2s or three R1s. Snap freeze. That doesn't go anywhere. Does this go anywhere? No. Okay. So this is just like a side path, I'm guessing? Okay. Alright. I'll probably check back at the end of the guide to make sure I'm not missing anything. I guess I probably should have checked for illusory. Something or other just to verify. Just to make sure we're not dealing with any illusory ice here. Let's roll into a couple ice cubes. It doesn't seem like it, though. I'm gonna say no. I'm executively thinking that this was just like a side path of loot guarded by the crabs. Oh, I missed a ladder. That might be more to the story here. Let's go up and see. How did I? When did I walk past that? <laughs> I got the item and I was just like, oh, there's a ladder by the dubs. I wonder if this isn't that ladder from. The other side of the bridge. That wouldn't be right, was it? Would it? No, because now we're on the uh, this side of the bridge. So this could lead to a million different places. Holy cow! This is a long ladder. playing a game of climb up the ladders here. This is ridiculous. This better lead somewhere useful. That's all I am to say. Oh my goodness, I swear if there's another letter, I'm gonna freak out. Okay. Tiny Salab! Okay, I get it. It was worth the climb. Whoa, yo, you just rolled backwards because I touched you? That was a bit strange. You guys are really unpleasant. Shriving Stone, Shriving Stone, whatever those are called. Oh, so we're just like right under here now? I bet, I bet you, I, oh my gosh, we could have gotten here this way. Okay, so you could completely bypass the tree area and go this way. Let me just get this quick while we're here. I'm so upset that that doesn't immediately kill you. It's so close to immediately killing you. Oh yeah, this is, oh yeah, oh yeah, that's not like an area. Okay, so we're going to go down and do that boss <clears throat> and hope he's worth it, like 60,000 souls. So, okay, so this is this literally just brought us to an area, and now we can't even get back down there. That's horrible. Oh, oh, so there's like, okay, all right, okay, all right, okay. 
So now we can't get back down there because we chose to drop down and get the bugs thing. Oh, so you can't get the Titanite slab. You have to climb up this, the ladders to get the Titanite slab. That's making more sense to me now. I was a little bit confused. You're telling me I can't drop off to get that over here, though? Let me just verify that conclusion. That would be right, right? Because it's... Let me use the bridge to verify that. Yeah. Yeah, because it's the hole up there. Which means we now have to go down again. Or Homeward Bone. That's why it gives you Homeward Bones there. How many do we have? If we have a lot... Oh my gosh, we have 28. Bonfire last rested at, please. I don't feel like going down the tree again. Alright, so now we're going to get on this boss. We got 5,000 souls, whatever. I, I'm, I, well, I, it could not be a boss, but I just mean, oh my goodness, this looks like a frosty version of, like, Sif's, well, the flowers, the flowers on the ground, what does that remind me of? It's like Garman's, Garman's boss fight, kind of, in Bloodborne? Really, that didn't start it? I just know there's something on the other side of that archway. I just know that there is. There he is. Are you a boss? You're not a boss? Oh, yeah, you are. Champion's Grave Tender. Oh my goodness. So you got wolves with you. I'm not into that, but... It's like Capper Demon. Better version. Whoa, okay. Mr. Grave Tender, sorry. Can I backstab you or anything? This is very interesting. Oh, the wolf's here. Okay. All right. I get it. I get it. Let me just polish this guy off. I'm guessing that we're not supposed to deal with them both at the same time. All right. Grave tender down. Where's the wolf? Oh, gosh. Oh, you're big. Oh, you're bigger than before. Oh, are you? Wait, maybe you're not. I don't know. You were a hard boss before. Okay. You're so they're very aggressive. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yes, sir. Is that it? Is that it? Or do we have to fight the wolves? Okay. Champion's Bones, Valor Heart. And we're restored. That was cool. That was a cool fight. Very Sif. Very Sif. Sif-ish. Okay, and we got the souls we needed, which is cool. So. <clears throat> Is that all? Is there a bonfire? Do I get a bonfire? Or do I just have to like homeward bone out of here? That was cool. Is Valor Heart a weapon? Oh, it is. What is it? Weapon once wielded by the champion of the undead match. A special paired set consisting of a broadsword and a lion shield. The champion fought on without rest until he lost his mind. In the end, only his page and a lone wolf stayed at his side. So, like, you can't use a shield if you use that weapon, because it has its own shield? That's a very strange um, idea. Is the other thing just the soul? Yeah, soul... No, soul of the twin princes. We didn't get a soul. Wait, what was the other item that we got? Shoot, shoot. I always tell myself to look at that, but I forgot to look at it. I don't know what it was. Key item? Champion's Bones. The charred but warm bones of a champion burn in the Firelink Shrine bonfire to participate in undead matches. Long ago, the un an undead declared a fight, a fight to celebrate their own death to preserve what remained of their souls, so it was that the undead matches were born. Oh, okay, so just like the Dark Souls 1 DLC, I guess now we have... Oh, there's the bonfire. I guess now we have... Um, what 
like a PvP kind of bonus from the DLC. So, we'll head back to Firelink Shrine. This might be a shorter episode because we just finished off the area and did that. So, cool. So we got Depths of the Painting, Arandel Chapel, and Rope Bridge. Okay, cool. Firelink Shrine. Well, that would make it seem if this is just the Ashes of Randall, it makes it seem like we're almost halfway through, which would make sense. I would, I, I think there's only two bosses in this because I know Ring and City is a lot bigger of a DLC, which raises the question of why they are the same price. What do I know? <clears throat> what do I know? Um, really quickly. Oh, Umbral Ash. Oh, okay. Wait, did we just get that? Where did we just get that at? Wow, I can buy slabs for only 30k? Oh my goodness, that's like freaking worth it. Upgrade materials are cheap. It's like they want you to upgrade multiple weapons. 30k. Captain's Ashes? I'm not sure if Captain's Ashes... Oh, it is. It's definitely DLC Ashes. Oh, cool. Milkwood Knight Armor. There's, we definitely are able to farm that off of them, probably. Or pick it up at the very least. Lorian, oh, that's from the last boss fight. I don't think I've checked through here. I have the Firelink stuff. We could buy some of this cool stuff instead of leveling. I feel like we really don't need to level up that much. I mean, we're past the 30s, which are soft caps. We could get to the 40s, I guess, because those are hard caps. I think the 40s are hard caps on most of the stats. I don't know. Let's see about weapon upgrades. Do I have any slabs left? Oh, I do. I have one slab. I have 65 larges, but I only have five chunks, so we might have to buy chunks if we want to upgrade anything else. Main force weapon. Okay, so what? We have dragon tooth plus four, so we could get that to plus five if we wanted to. That would probably be a fun weapon, but blunt. Havel's blunt weapon. We could get broadsword to plus ten, but I'm, I'm leaning away from that. This is definitely the strength build, so... Ooh, milkwood battle axe. It only requires 15 strength, so it must not actually be that heavy. I guess it didn't look that heavy. We could get that hammer that they have, though. That would be just wonderful. Maybe we'll just get Dragon Tooth to plus 10, or plus 5, I mean, that would be fun. Just to have it as an option. See what kind of damage it gets, gets up to. Thank you. I don't think I want to buy anything specifically from... Some of soul that's fallen night. I don't freaking remember how much it is. Let's just see how many is in here, just so we know. Oh, 20k, okay, that's way more than we need. So that means we could um we could buy another slab and upgrade more stuff really easily, actually. We'll just do one level. Um 45 strength. Scaling is still two points on that, but I think, honestly, I'm pretty happy with where damage is at. I don't need to keep messing with that. I guess we should get... This stuff is good. Like, wow, 33 endurance. We'll get it up to 35 and then vigor to 40. I think that should be our approach. I'm going to focus on endurance because I'm feeling okay about my health right now. So I really want to be able to just... I don't know. I guess we do have a lot of endurance. I don't know why it feels ah. short to me. Um, okay. Let me think, let me think. I guess we don't get we didn't get a boss soul for that, so I can't really transpose anything. Okay, so should I buy some upgrade materials or should I buy some fits? Maybe we should buy some fits. Maybe we should buy a fit. We could wear the cool I bet it's just heavy as heck though. The milkwood set. A fifteen. It's not that bad. I don't know if I'm into that though. It's a little tanky looking. We do love our Firelink armor. Not sure what would be a good fit. It's nothing too heavy, because we need to still be rolling around pretty late. Honestly, I guess we don't really need anything. We don't need anything. And the Legion stuff. Fair um. I don't know that I need anything. Just buy upgrade materials to have them. I'm really liking Great Machete so far. I think it has just been working really well. For what we're trying to do here. Ashen one. 
does um can I see the stats on I think what what we could make we could transpose Lorian's greatsword if we wanted to. Lorian's yeah, see Lorian's greatsword. Which is the yeah. Does it have any requirement though? Oh it doesn't. It just has fire on it. So it, it doesn't require any bonuses. And we can definitely wield it, so it's mostly a strength weapon. But it scales with DD. Scaling wouldn't be very good for us. But I feel like fire damage would be helpful here. I don't know. I'm happy with the weapons that we're working with. I don't know why I keep messing with stuff. I really just don't need to, so. I guess why don't we just crank out? We have enough souls that we could just pull out another level, honestly. Let's do one of these. If they're 20, then these must be 10, so if we're up to 35 and we use three of these, please let these be 10. Yep. Yay. Let's just go 35, so I can, I'm can. i going to be happy with that at 35. I don't think it needs to go any higher than that. All right. And I guess we'll stop that there. Oh, burn champions. I just did it. Oh, so now I can go to Undead Match. Okay. Okay. That's very interesting. And we got a lot of stuff going on in the bonfire, but that's okay. Okay, I think I'm going to end the episode here um, with we'll travel back to Roadbridge Cave. Yeah, and we'll pick up from there. So, again, thank you for watching. We have one boss down, and I'd say one area down, and we're going to be heading on to the next area. So.